famous if we do that. Hey, you're going to take up. I was about to say, let me know, I'll let him hang. <laughs> and like, I ain't got no sweet tooth, boy. All right, guys, after like weeks of nagging this fool, Richard. Come on, man. He's building a 350Z. Look at this thing. I don't know why he said weeks. It's been years. Look how happy he is up under there working on his car. It's been years. <laughs> So he got a pretty decent deal for this thing. Um, it's not in the best of shape, but like I said, it's gonna be a drift car, so it don't really matter. But of course, like most 350Zs, it's blown up, but he is actually the original owner of the 350Z that I just picked up, and it had a good D in it and a good transmission. So we're gonna pull this engine and just swap the engines and fire this thing up. So we might get it running this video, I'm not sure, but I'm just gonna like, sit around and do video stuff while these guys work on this thing. What? What? <laughs> yeah. What? So, hey, I want to see other people do work instead of me doing it all the time. You <laughs> say like he's trying to be a viewer now. Yeah. I know. At but, this point, go and start recording. You know what? <laughs> well, we got a wiring harness and everything. It was already... Got a yeah, we got channels. <laughs> oh, yeah, this would be like a collab right here. See, you ain't even recording. So you're not even recording. This could be like a little YouTube collab. But last week. <laughs> it's all right. Like this. Oh shoot! There is a clutch in this thing, man. Hey, Amen. Looks. I can see like a brand new flywheel in there. Yeah, he said he has a brand new flywheel and um clutch yeah, in there. So okay. That's what I'm saying. I want to open it up a little bit. I see it peeking out through there. All right. Yeah. So th this dude's actually in a pretty good situation. He's got. Uh, a DE with a bad head gasket and a you know CDO one whatever transmission yeah. grinding in third and a whole nother transmission engine so you, I told him I was like fix this and then have a backup engine so but for the guys that don't know if you're pulling your engine out of your Z disconnect the harness and just lay it on the engine kind of like this so pull it out of the firewall right here disconnect it right there and you lay on the engine Pull it all out together. Don't try to disconnect the harness from the engine and transmission. Make your life way easier. But I'll update you guys here in a second. Like I said, the motor is pretty much ready to come out. So we're just going to get this thing swinging, put another engine in there, and uh, we'll get into some detail stuff when we start putting it in there. So. You on the YouTube? YouTubes? <laughs> well, I told you guys time and time again it's always something it ain't never going to go as easy as smooth as you want it to i've never seen this but look at that it's like the freaking i don't know i've never seen the cross member crack right there so i'm just gonna throw some extremely ugly weld on it hammer on both down flat and we just gonna let her let her ride so yeah but we got the engine out of this junk Colton, he's pulling the transmission apart so we can see which clutch is the better clutch out of the two. And then we're going to take the wiring harness off, dress this engine up, put this transmission on it, and sit it in there. So, see, it's just going to be just that easy, right? <laughs> but I just want to show you all that cross mirror. I've never even seen that before, but uh, we'll get the engine sitting there in just a second. <laughs> but wear wise, how long would it take for me to wear it down? Huh? That was his choice to do the green. Instead of, I told the man I had some black paint too, but it should be a problem. Hey man, this I'm not, I'm not worried about it. You gonna get Dino some of that hot dog? He worried about it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, like I said, once we get the engine and everything, the transmission hooked together and stuff, and I'll like show you guys the sitting it in there. So I'm not gonna do much work after this. So you know, my work, my my work, my, my, my working is done. <laughs> Okay, so we worked on this thing pretty much, you know, past dark. Uh, those guys took off, and like I said, I know I said I was going to record them putting the engine in, but I just I had to help the guys out. I'm not going to just sit there and like, you know, watch these guys struggle putting this engine in by themselves. I know the pain of doing that, so <laughs> I'm not going to make them do it. But like I said, we got the engine in this thing, got the wiring harness and everything dressed on it. So when they come over today. You know, we'll get the uh, the computer and everything hooked up, um, reassemble the front, and I think the previous owner sold the differential out of it. So we'll get that taken care of. This is the old engine, which apparently has a bad head gasket. So 
maybe we'll make a video of uh, putting some head gaskets on this thing if you guys are interested. But I don't think y'all really got to see the car. Um, but it's really not bad shape. It's sad that people part out cars like this just because they blow up. I mean, this was a, looks like a fairly nice car. So he sold the A-pillar off of it, which I have one that's cracked. So I'm just going to throw my man a, a window sill and just let him glue the crack one in place. The color's the same, so it'll work out pretty good for him. Side skirt's a little beat up, you know, not perfect. And I think he sold the seat side of it and piled a bunch of junk in the car. So. But th this ain't nothing. Buy you a clapped out Z and get this, get it on the road. This is, like it looks pretty bad, but it's not that bad. And he sold the, the window stuff out of it. But we're gonna get this thing all fixed up. So we already got the engine in here. Today when they come over, you know, we'll get everything hooked up and get this thing running. But you guys will see that in the next video because as of right now, we're done with this thing until later today. But I'm gonna go work on my own car. So you'll see that in the next video.